Some local used car dealerships in our area have remained open throughout the pandemic. KLBK's Brenda Lipinski spoke to a couple of dealerships in the area about some of the trends that they've been seeing during this time. Brenda, how has business been for them? Well, Terry, that's a great question. Most of them saw a spike after the stimulus checks were issued. After that, each dealership saw different results. However, one thing is common, and that is that some customers are just not making as much money these days. Leticia Palos is making one of her last car payments for a car she purchased three years ago. She says this pandemic has really affected her income. So right now, we're, we, we're making, I'm making about half of what I used to make at work. And with less funds, she says she's been concerned about making her car payments. We pay on time every month. We're good customers. But when this pandemic hit, I was like, what am I going to get the money to pay if it keeps on longer than, you know, six weeks, seven weeks? Joe Sutton, owner of Depot Auto Sales, says he's seen more and more people struggling financially, which has caused a big slowdown in sales. We're seeing people have less, you know, to put down on a vehicle as well. I've definitely seen a, a difference as far as you know, there's a lot of people, a lot more people on unemployment, a lot of people that, uh, you know, that are looking for vehicles that don't have jobs, which is, you know, definitely hard to buy a car when you don't have a job to pay for it. Ben Hernandez says his business has seen people have a similar struggle and says his business has been fortunate amid this pandemic. We have not seen a decrease. I mean, we don't have a big increase, but good enough sales to be, you know, selling cars. And he says with less money in people's pockets, people are thinking twice about what they spend their money on. They're spending their money more wisely. As for Leticia, she offers advice for those who could be in a similar situation. Don't ignore the people you make the car payment to. A lot of times they're understandable, they'll work with you, you know, trying to hide the car and stuff. I've seen people do that. My neighbor, my poor neighbor, He's going through that. I mean, he hides his car every month when he has the payment comes up. Yeah, I mean, call them, talk to them, and they'll help you out. Now, Mr. Sutton says if you're going to buy a vehicle and you can't afford a new one, go in the in-house route with the buy here, pay here option. Terry, 